It's Evil Blood here, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a good combat game without scripting. Because scripting is a very hard subject, and it's really hard to do on your games, and it's even hard for me. So, yeah, I'm just gonna show you guys how to make a cool combat game without scripting. So, first, you wanna go create new game, then, you wanna choose any one of these. I'm going to choose the flat terrain for the purpose of this video. And then you want to create game. Now let's go edit it. Open Roblox Studio. There, it's opening. So let's just wait until it loads. So here we are. So now what we're going to do, since it's winter, I'm going to be making this game um, a winter game. So let's make this a combat game. Um, instead of swords, we're going to add guns. So I'm going to be teaching you guys also how to add working and successful guns in this game. So what you want to do, you want to go to models and you want to go FE. So as you can see, I have roll FE over here. So now you want you can choose any of these guns. So right now, let's choose um, gun. Uh, let's use AK-47. Yes. So in order for these guns to work, what you want to do is you want to go to the game settings right here, and you want to change the avatar settings to R6 and you want to click the yes and now you want to save it and there you go now we have our starter pack so everyone will have um, the AK-47 gun oh what did I do to the oh control Z okay workspace okay so now what you want to do you want to add a map to the game so I already have my map. It's going to be let's see. Let's go map. So if you guys want to find good combat maps, you can just go maps. Or you can just make your own map, which I'm just I'm going to show you guys in the next video. If you guys if you guys want to make a lobby or a map, a game map. So let's go ahead and click combat league cuz that's has a lot of votes and I've used it in my game so here it is it's a combat map as you can see there's an underground tunnel and all that so now we got our map so for the winter theme um, what I'm gonna do I'm gonna change this whole place to ice instead of grass and rocks so for that, what you want to do is you want to go to the color and you want to turn it to this one. Click that. As you can see, it already looks like ice. But if you want to turn it to real ice, just go material and you can click the ice button. Ice. As you can see, it's ice. But um, it doesn't matter if you want to change your terrain to ice as well you could if you want to like that and like that but I'm not really gonna do that because people are not gonna go into the terrain they're gonna be in this map and now um let's test it play let's go to the test button and then you have to go play as you can see the map successfully worked and our AK-47 works as well. So if you're on a computer and you want to zoom this in, you do not press um, Q, like in Phantom Forces. I also play Phantom Forces and most of the controls are same for this, except if you have a mouse, you want to click the second button. So if you click that, it will go like that, and it will shoot. As you can see, um, there's a bullet area here 
and that's where it'll show you the amount of bullets you have and how much you're shooting. So there are different types of FE guns and I recommend you guys use them. And if you want to walk faster, just click the shift button on your keyboard. So remember, if you want these FE guns to work, you have to put your avatar mode to R6. So you want to do that, I'm going to I'm just going to show you guys again. You want to go to home and you want to go here and game settings. And then you'll see an avatar you'll see an avatar button here. You want to click that and it shows that you can do R6 or R15 or it's the player's choice. And you can also customize how the players would look, which I don't recommend you do. If you want to do it, you could, but I'm not going to do that. And you can also th turn them to R throw. For the basic info, if you want your place to be seen by your friends and played by your friends or the public, so everyone can play it. So for now, I'm going to save it to public. So now we want teams or yeah, teams. So for that, actually for this video, we're not going to do teams, but we're going to make um, sides. So let's, so this is going to be, we're going to rename this our map one. And then, um, let's go to, so there is a leaderboard that you guys can use if you type cash leaderboard. So you can, so let's do cash leaderboard. My cash leaderboard, cash money leaderboard. And it gives you plus one cash every second. I'll leave this model in the description below. And yeah, so if you go test and if you want to play this, it'll show your cash and it says in you'll get 10 cash every second. So that's actually a good model to use. I would recommend using that because it's kind of hard for other models. And if you guys want me to do more tutorials like this, I'll you can just leave a comment below and I always read my comments. I love when people comment on my channel and yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video and I'll see you next time.